Hello everyone. Today we will discuss about rectifier. Rectifier is a device which converts alternating current into direct current. For that we need a transformer, then a alternating source. As we know, transformer has two terminal. One is primary and another one is secondary. Then there is a core. At the secondary, if there is one diode only then it is called a half wave rectifier then we will get the output at the load if only one half cycle is converted to output then it is called half wave rectifier as you can see in the diagram here this is the positive half cycle of ac which is converted into output so this is called half wave rectifier at the positive half cycle this terminal becomes positive and as positive terminal is connected to p type so we will get the output like this similarly for the negative half cycle this terminal becomes negative so negative terminal is connected to p type so we will not get the output because negative terminal is connected to p type so it is reverse bias as in the reverse bias there is no current in the output okay so if we we'll add these two input we will get get a sinusoidal wave which is the alternating current that means the source and for this to half cycle we get the output as you can see we get only positive half cycle so what is Rectification. Rectification is the process by which an alternating current is converted into direct current. This is called rectification. And the device which converts alternating current into direct current is called rectifier. This is the device okay, which converts alternating current into direct current. And this device is called half wave rectifier. then we will discuss about full wave rectifier same in full wave rectifier also we need a transformer which has both primary and secondary terminal and in the middle section there is a core iron core but here there are two diodes but here we need a center tap transformer that means the center of the transformer is tapped by the output and here we will get the output so that means here we will connect a load as you can see here we have connected a load so for positive half cycle this terminal becomes forward bias because positive terminal is connected to p type so d1 becomes forward bias and we get the output so for this positive half cycle we get the output similarly for negative half cycle this terminal becomes forward bias and this terminal becomes reverse bias because negative terminal is connected to p type so we get output for d1 and d2 okay so this is output for d1 and this is the output for d2 if we will add both input and output okay then the input becomes a sinusoidal wave and the output is this one that is a direct current so but this direct current is 
a fluctuating direct current but that means it has some AC so to convert this fluctuating DC into a constant DC we need a filter circuit so by connecting a filter circuit we can convert this pulsating DC into constant DC so for positive half cycle D1 becomes for forward bias and we get the output like this and for negative half cycle D2 becomes forward bias and we get the output like this and finally the output becomes a DC thank you